Well, hi there, this is John Tang, and another project we have going on at the house here is stripping the stamped concrete driveway. The contractors who put a coat coating over the top of the stamped concrete when we initially moved here, probably eight years ago, used a lacquer finish, and it lasted about two weeks, I think, if I remember correctly. They put it in the high heat, they did not clean the surface well. It was a run and gun job, and uh, I totally regret bringing them here to do that. And it's basically looked like what you see over here towards the garage since then. Kind of this mottled look, there's some, uh, some of that is just the, the dried out lacquer. Some of our salt stains. And uh, it's just, it's a terrible look. It's a terrible look. So we finally broke down here and decided just to really muscle our way through Stripping all of this off lacquer is a terrible thing. In fact, I was told by one contractor that they just do not want to remove lacquer. It's just a nightmare. And it's turned out to be just that. Uh, this driveway here has really been difficult to strip. This right here is a product that we that I picked up at the hardware store. And it is called Jasco's Premium Paint and Epoxy Remover. That one gallon there will take about... For, at least in, for our driveway, about nine square feet. And this driveway is about 1,500 square feet. So we're going through a lot. The gallon's about $30. And now I know why the contractors don't want to come here and do this, but um, this really is the before and after. So you can see it's kind of being scraped away now. It turns into almost like a mud. Almost into a mud. Scraping it out of all the crevices here. After this is all taken out, we'll come through with a buffer and steel wool the whole driveway down. But this is ended up what we get afterwards. You know, it's just a beautiful, fresh look, a clean palette. We still have the curbs to take care of. And although this has been a very painstaking process to do, in the end, I'm gonna faux finish this driveway. We're going to turn this into just the lights and the dark, some brown, maybe a little bit of red. Going to pop it with an acrylic glossy finish. I'm going to add some sand to the mix in order to create traction because certainly when you add that clear coat finish over that glossy look over the top, it gets slick. Add the sand additive to it, spray gun it over the top, and turn this driveway into a Michelangelo painting. So super excited about that. Jasco paint and epoxy remover. This is what it takes to get lacquer off your driveway. And incidentally, please never put lacquer outside on your driveway. Learn from my mistake.